<laughs> the of the Washington Post is worried. Newspaper editors across the United States are troubled. Their concern and mine, why have young Americans stopped reading newspapers? The flight from the press means that your impressionable young are subjected to a cocktail of influences, such as movies, TV chat shows and rock songs. And these are likely to lead to them building irrational views. If, for instance, the only viewpoint they hear on the Los Angeles riots comes from rap artist Sister Soldier, or their understanding of President Kennedy's assassination stems only from Oliver Stone's movie JFK, then imagine the emergent ideology. People will think of riots as a totally reasonable response to racial tension and conceive of Kennedy's death as a CIA plot. Of course, pop music and Hollywood films have always had an influence, but this used to be filtered through daily experience, which included the newspaper reading habit. Only in newspapers can people hope to read a diversity of views from a variety of informed sources. Now, with fewer and fewer young people reading newspapers or, incidentally, watching TV news, you face the prospect of an ill-informed generation of American youth. Is this a benefit to the world's largest democratic nation? The remedy is in your hands. Go out and buy a newspaper today. This is Roy Greenstade in London for CBS News. Hmm, thank you, Roy. We're back after a break. This is CBS News.